Hi everyone, today we are going to learn about the Nobel Prize winners of 2023. The Nobel Prize winners in physics. They are Pierre Agostini, Franz Krauss and Annie L. Hiller. They won the Nobel Prize for for experimental methods that generate auto second pulses of light for the study of electron dynamics in matter. Let's learn something about them. Pierre Agostini is a French experimental physicist and emeritus professor at Ohio State University. Known for his pioneering work in strong field delays of physics and auto second science, he is especially known for the observation of above threshold ionization and the invention of the reconstruction of auto second beating by interference of two photon transition, they shortly called as rabbit technique for catechization of photosecond light pulses. He was awarded Nobel Prize in Physics in 2023. His field is autosecond physics. Franz Krauss is a Hungarian-Austrian physicist working in autosecond science. He is a director at the Max Planck Institute of Quantum Optics and a professor of experimental physics at the Ludwig Maximilian University of Munich in Germany. His research team has generated and measured the first autosecond light pulse and used it for capturing electrons, motion inside atoms, marking the birth of autophysics. His field is autosecond physics. He won Nobel Prize for Physics in 2023. Annie Genevieve Elhuller is a French Swedish physicist and professor of atomic physics at Lund University in Sweden. She leads an autosecond physics group which studies the movements of electrons in real time which is used to understand the chemical reactions on the atomic level. Her experimental and theoretical research are credited with laying the foundation for the field of autohemistry. In 2003, she and her group beat the world record for the shortest laser pulse of 170 autoseconds. L. Hilla became a member of the Royal Swedish Academy of Science in 2004. She was awarded Nobel Prize for Physics in 2023. The Nobel Prize winners in Physiology or Medicine. They are Kathleen Carco and Ray Westman. They won the Nobel Prize for, for their discoveries concerning nucleoside based modifications that enable the development of effective mRNA vaccines against COVID-19. Let's learn something about them. Katlin or Kati Kariko is a Hungarian-American biochemist who specializes in rib ribonucleic acid mediated mechanisms particularly in vitro transcribed messenger RNA for protein replacement therapy. Carico laid the scientific groundwork for mRNA vaccines, overcoming major obstacles and skepticism in the scientific community. She has received more than 130 international awards and honors for their pioneering and globally significant work in biochemistry. In 2023, she got Nobel Prize in Physiology and Medicine for the development of mRNA technology. Drew Westman is an American physician and immunologist known for his contributions of RNA biology. Wisman is the inaugural Roberts Family Professor in Vaccine Research, Director of the Penn Institute for RNA Innovation and Professor of Medicine at the Perelman School of Medicine at the University of Pennsylvania. Wisman's works underlies the development of mRNA vaccines, the best known of which are those for COVID-19 produced by BioNTech or Cypher and Moderna. He won Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine in 2023 for their discoveries concerning nucleoside-based modification that enabled the development of effective mRNA vaccines against COVID-19. The, the Nobel Prize winners for chemistry. Mogni G. Bhavanti and Louis E. Bruce and Alexei Hai Ehimov. 
They won the Nobel Prize for, for the discovery and synthesis of quantum atoms. Monkey Gabriel Bavanti is an American, Tunisian, French chemist. He is currently the Lester Wolf Professor at the Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Bavanti is known for his advances in the chemical production of high quality quantum dots. He was awarded Nobel Prize for Chemistry in 2023. Louis Bruce is the S.L. Mitchell Professor of Chemistry at Columbia University. He is the core discoverer of the colloidal semiconductor nanocrystals known as quantum dots. He was awarded Nobel Prize in 2023. Alex Ekhimov is a Russian solid state physicist who discovered the semiconductor nanocrystals known as quantum dots in 1981 while working at the Pueblo State Optical Institute. In 1967, he graduated from the Faculty of Physics, Leningrad State University. He was awarded the 1975 USSR State Prize in Science and Engineering for work on electron spin orientation in semiconductors. He is co-recipient of the 2006 R.W. Wood Prize of the Optical Society of America for discovery of nanocrystal quantum dots and pioneering studies for their electronic and optical properties shared with Alexander Lefros and Louis Bruce. He was awarded Nobel Prize in 2023. Since 1999, Ekimov has been living and working in the United States as a scientist for nanocrystals technology, a company based in New York State. The Nobel Prize in Literature John Foss, he won the Nobel Award for, for his innovative plays and proofs which give voice to the unsayable. John Olaf Fossey is the Norwegian writer, author, translator and playwright. Fossey's work spans over 70 novels, poems, children's books, essays and theatre plays, which have been translated into over 50 languages. The most performed Norwegian playwright after Henrik Ibsen Fosse is one of the most performed contemporary playwrights globally. His minimalist and deeply introspective plays with a language often bordering on lyrical prose and poetry have been noted to represent a modern continuation of the dramatic tradition established by Henrik Ibsen in the 19th century. Fosse work has often been placed within the tradition of post-dramatic theatre he won Nobel Prize in 2023. The Nobel Prize in Peace Nargis Ahmadi won the Nobel Prize for, for her fight against the oppression of women in Iran and her fight to promote human rights and freedom for all. Let's learn about her. Nargis Ahmadi is an Iranian human rights activist and Nobel laureate. She is the vice president of the Defenders of Human Rights Center, headed by her fellow Nobel Peace Prize laureate Shirin Ebadi. Mahamadi has been a vocal proponent of mass feminist civil disobedience against hijab in Iran and a vocal critics of the hijab and chastity program of 2023. In October 2023, while in prison, she was awarded the 2023 Nobel Peace Prize for her fight against the oppression of women in Iran and her fight to promote human rights and freedom for all. The Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Iran condemned the decision to award Mahamadi. The Nobel Prize in Economic Science Claudia Goldwyn, he won the Nobel Prize for for having advanced our understanding of women's labor market outcomes. Let's learn about her. Claudia Dale Godlin is an American economic historian and labor economist who is currently the Henry Lee Professor of Economics at Harvard University. She is a co-director of the NBS Gender in the Economy Study Group and was the director at the NBS Development of the American Economy Program from 1989 to 2017. Golden's research covers a wide range of topics, including the female labor force, 
the gender gap in the earnings, income inequality, technological change, education and immigration. Her recently completed book, Career and Family, Women's Century Long Journey Toward Equity was released on October 5, 2021. Her work in studying women's work and labor market outcomes is evidenced in its impact on the fields of economics and economic history, including women's role in economic development. Golden was the president of the American Economic Association in 2013-14 to 14 academic year. In 1990, Golden became the first tenured woman in Harvard's economics department. In 2023, she was awarded the Nobel Memorial Prize in Economic Science for having advanced our outstanding, sorry, our understanding of women's labor market outcomes. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and subscribe.